guns down. Now! Put them down! Brother man, put your gun down. I'm gonna bomb the shit out of them. It's true. Earlier this week, we debunked the whole bomb hoax thing. 33 bomb hoax, hoax phone calls into schools in Ohio and leftards everywhere blamed it on the uh, 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 alcohol. Sorry, leftists everywhere were blaming it on Donald Trump talking about the Haitian migrant story. And so they want to go with this narrative. They're going to go with it no matter what, even if it's been debunked and it has been debunked. But Anna, Miss Navarro, says... It doesn't matter if it's fake. I will double down because the story fits my narrative too perfectly. <laughs> Written by me. Just a little joke. Just a little jokey. But listen to this. It, uh, honestly, this is today. It's been three days since the story was debunked. But it doesn't matter to these people because the narrative is too good. With you. It's, you know, I think we should all question the rhetoric. The problem is that Donald Trump, who I, I think, you know, if you were doing hurricane categories, he's on hurricane category five, whereas uh, the other side might be a two. And Did you call Donald Trump a hurricane category five? That's crazy, man. That's a funny joke. I wrote this in my room the other day. Donald Trump is like a hurricane. And if he was a hurricane, he'd be a hurricane category five. Anna, tell us what to think. With you. It's, you know, I think we should all question the rhetoric. The yes. problem is that Donald Trump, who I, I think, you know, if you were doing hurricane categories, he's on hurricane category five. Well, that's a whereas, big category. Uh, the other side might be a two. Really? And Donald Trump and J.D. Vance are yes. not questioning the rhetoric right now right. because of their rhetoric, because of what tell he us. said in that debate. Yes. There's been... 33 bombing threats and she's like um you know that story has been debunked right and then she's like it doesn't matter it's a good story and i already wrote the script on this last week springfield ohio that would not have happened but ha -happen. for this false conspiracy theory being spread by oh can i hear that one more time it was almost like you accuse Donald Trump of doing exactly what you're doing. Are you on drugs? Excuse me, are you doing some of that drug that all the kids are doing? That you suck in all that gas? Is that what you're doing? Because you're losing your mind. Field, Ohio. That would not have happened but for this false conspiracy theory being spread by the Ooh. vice presidential and presidential Republican candidate. We call that and irony. those Haitians in Springfield, Ohio, yes. and those students and the people that are victims right. of these threats and everything that's going on there yes. don't have 24 7 ser a secret service. Oh. Right? They're on their own with you. Right, because um, they don't need to have 24 7 secret service because the story wasn't real. Okay. The story wasn't real. Turned out that the governor came out and said that all the calls were apparently from overseas. Now, we haven't had any confirmation about where overseas these calls came from, but they weren't from America. And so the narrative that you're choosing isn't real. And we also know something about children, that they like to call in these fake threats because it cancels school. And in Florida right now, they're getting or cracking down on it because it's a problem. But it's insane that these people just like double down. It's like, like it takes two seconds to look up this information. I have a full time job. I do this show for fun. We have a good time. We have a good community. I like what we do together. We have good times. We have good times and great oldies. Cool one or two point five. <laughs> and I can look it up. Now, if I can look it up, I know you can. You have writers. You have people that can look up and fact check for you. You have interns on staff to do the work for you, but yet you refuse. Now, why is that? Is it because you want to win no matter what? Is it because you don't care about the truth and all you do is care about winning? Is that what you people are caring about on The View these days, huh? The most trustworthy news source, The View? No chance. <laughs> I 